If a number is randomly chosen from the following list, what is the probability that the number is a multiple of 5? So once again, we want to find we want to find the fraction of the total possibilities that meet our constraint. And our constraint is being a multiple of 5. So how many total possibilities are there? Let's think about that. Total total possibilities. Possibilities. Total possibilities. How many do we have? Well, that's just the, the, the total number of numbers we have to pick from. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So there are 12 possibilities. We have an equal chance of picking any one of these 12. Now, which of these 12 are, num are a multiple of 5? So let's, let me do this in a different color. So let me pick out the multiples of 5. 32 is not a multiple of 5. 49 is not a multiple of 5. 55 is a multiple of 5. Really, we're just looking for the numbers that, in the ones place, either have a 5 or a 0. 55 is a multiple of 5. 30 is a multiple of 5. That's 6 times 5. That's 55 is 11 times 5. Not 56, not 28. This is clearly 5 times 10. This is, this is 8 times 5. This is the same number again. Also 8 times 5, so all of these are multiples of 5. 45, that's a 9 times 5. 3 is not a multiple of 5. 25, clearly 5 times 5. So I've circled all of the multiples of 5. So of all the possibilities, the ones that meet our constraint of being a multiple of 5, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 possibilities. So 7 meet our constraint. Meet our meet our constraints. So in this example, the probability of selecting a number that is a multiple of 5 is 7 twelfths.